Reef DVM's coming at you today with part two of the cart. Uh, we want to make this cart a utility cart, and I've already shown the video on the Pioneer Summit cart. And now we opened up an aluminum trailer box. These are all the parts for it. It's, um, I think, uh, 40 by 48. Here we'll look on the box here, and it'll tell me in a second. Yeah, it's 40 inches by 48 inches. This is an aluminum trailer kit. You can buy these at Northern Tool and pretty much turn them into anything. Um, the nice thing about this is, is this is going to work with our Pioneer Summit cart. So I've got the kids putting it together. Um, they actually love wrenching this and putting it together. It's a good experience for them. Got our farm hand and my daughters on it. and They threw this cart together pretty quickly. Now once they get it together, we're going to adapt it to our needs so it's not going to look like this at the end. The Summit Pioneer cart that we already showed the release video on um, a little bit back here is uh, a great utility cart. We plan on using it um, quite a bit uh, for dragging the driveways, pulling things with the horses, and so forth. But we also want to be able to carry more people. And instead of investing in a bigger buggy, which could cost, you know, thousands of dollars used or, you know, literally up to 10000 new, um, for the time being, we're going to invest in a trailer and we're going to have her pull a cart for people in it. So kind of like a double jointed or uh, like a tractor trailer kind of thing. So um, this is us putting on a uh, marine grade plywood floor. Uh, we got that bolted on. We actually drilled through the aluminum. One thing nice about working with aluminum is it's extremely light for the horses. And it's very easy to work with because you can drill through it and make it what you want. Uh, we want to put seats on this and we'd like it to match the Summit Pioneer cart. So called over to the folks over there at uh, uh, Pioneer. And uh, they were quite gracious, and uh, they sold us a pair of seats. Um, so the exact seats that are on the Summit cart, um, they shipped out to us, which was fantastic. Um, they work with uh, um, Olson Carriage and Harness out in Colorado, and we were able to, to pay them as the distributor, so to speak, and uh, the manufacturer sent them directly to us. Bolted these bad boys together. Now we're going to not put these on the same mounts as the, as the cart was mounted, um, in the previous video, but we are going to mount them to some big uh, two by um, sixes or two by eights. So here's the cart when we got the floor on it. As you can see, it's it's looking great. What we're going to do is uh, we're going to use the receiver hitch function on the um, uh, Summit Pioneer cart, and then this one and seven eighths ball will hook right to it. These are the seats that came. I'm sorry for the sawdust. We had been cutting the floor at the same day we were installing the seats, so everything got full of sawdust as we were ripping wood to make it fit the trailer. Seats to go together very easy. Um, we had to kind of design which way we wanted the seats to run. We started with uh, kind of a more perpendicular look and ended up going more with this look. Um, it turned out really good. It's quite comfortable to sit on, which is nice, being that this trailer has got, you know, leaf springs in it. And the seats have a spring in it. It's really actually quite enjoyable ride. It's, it's a fun little ride. So once we got it kind of set up the way we wanted, um, we finished taping and, and prepping and, you know, got the paint check code from Pioneer and, uh, you know, all the family helped out. <laughs> My little son here is just probably taking tools and playing with them more than he's actually physically doing work. But um, we blasted her red, um, turned it into the same color as uh, the cart that we built in the previous video. And I have that link in the... Um, in the uh, suggested information or, or comment section if you'd like to go see that video. But here it is before we mount the seats back on it. It's a nice little utility trailer. Again, 40 inches by 48 inches. Any one of my kids can wheel this around in the in the shop. It's, it's that easy to maneuver. We absolutely love it. Uh, we've taken it out and already tried it. Obviously, it's an inaugural run. We decided not to put a horse on it and... Um, Took it out and used it on on the Gator, so put it on the on the 590M and uh, drove it around. Um, put it through its paces. Actually, went faster than what a horse even would pull this cart, and did absolutely fantastic. So here it is, set up with the Pioneer cart, folks. What more can I say? This has been a fantastic uh, cart for us, um, and now it's got the ability to pull people. Um, as you can see, I added the jack there to the back end of it to keep it up. And um, it's all set to go. Thank you for watching. Please like or subscribe. We'll keep putting out great videos like this.